The process of deciding who gets admitted to specialty schools in Richmond is changing. After discussing several plans, the school board decided last night which one to move forward with. 8 News reporter Alexis Bellamy is outside the school board office with what's included in the plan. Well, specialty schools garnered a lot of feedback from both school board members and parents. Now, the board has decided to move forward with a proposed plan to change the admission process when it comes to these specialty schools. School board members have had previous discussions when it comes to ensuring a level playing field for students when they apply to these schools, especially when it comes to economically disadvantaged students. Leaders explored multiple ideas to refresh the admissions process, but ultimately decided to add two extra guaranteed seats for each middle school at all specialty schools and set aside half of the available seats for economically disadvantaged students. Three seats will also be added for the three highest scoring private school and homeschool students. Here's Dr. Shonda Harris Mohammed with the 6th District. It is the process of admissions and the who behind the reviewing the admissions that RPS must address first and not the cap. I firmly believe we have a lack of representation of black and brown students in our specialty schools. No doubt, hands down. We know the statistics. RPS must address our own process to ensure our process of admissions is not fair, but equitable. And according to the school district's website, applications for these specialty schools will be available on Friday, October 13th. After that, students and their families will have until December 1st to resubmit those applications. In Richmond, Alexis Bellamy, 8 News.